I made your favorite Bluey characters out of Lego bricks. Bluey has become one of my all-time favorite shows ever, and right after watching it, I got straight to designing the characters in Lego, and this is what I came up with. Of course, we're going to start with Bluey. A few of the bricks had to be recolored to match the character. Now to make the face with a custom sticker, but first, I have to poke a hole to fit the stud. Perfect. And there she is. I'm super happy with how she turned out. On to Bluey's sister, Bingo. I made her about a brick shorter than Bluey. I'm not gonna lie though, she looks pretty freaky without a nose. Moving on to the Big Daddy Man, Bandit. He's a lot larger than the kid figures and has a really interesting technique for the snout using this bar and a Minecraft head. Of course, the show can't go on without Chili. I attempted to make her a little smaller than Bandit, but she came out looking kinda fat, so I just made her the same height, and I think that looks fine. To add to our collection of healers, I built the cousins, starting with Muffin. To make this hyper healer, I made her one plate shorter than Bingo, but unfortunately, this hinders her and Socks from having tails. Socks is almost the same as Muffin. I know she's supposed to be kind of purple, but I only noticed that after ordering the stickers and bricks. Since he is their next door neighbor, I thought it would be nice to build Lucky. Almost half the bricks were painted, so the colors are a bit wacky here and there. I even had someone tell me he looks like a stick of butter, and I can't argue with that. Rusty's one of my favorite characters, so I couldn't not include him. Like in the show, he's almost exactly the same as Bluey. I even built him a cricket bat so he can play cricket. Next, I built Winton. I think his mouth tile makes him look really funny. You can even switch out his arms to make him look absolutely shredded, like in the episode stories. Now to make Jean-Luc's rival, Mackenzie. He has the most unique design, making use of these claw pieces for his fluffy hair. And as an added bonus, here's my build for Pom Pom. She can't have legs, so she just kind of rolls around. That's why I added a tail, to always keep her upright. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know what Bluey characters you want to see next. And if you'd like to make Lego Bluey a real set, check out the video on the left.